There are about 20 million crickets in these room. Here, they'll live out their lives freely until they're transformed into food. Most of these crickets will be milled into a powder that can be used like a flour. Or, you can actually snack on them whole, like a chips. Even though it may look like a strange choice for food, crickets actually contain more protein than beef. For most of us, crickets are just the soundtrack of our summer nights, filling the warm air with their soothing chirps. But, crickets are more than just nature's musicians. They are crucial for the environment for soil aeration and decomposition, and serving as a food source for many animals. In recent years, crickets have found their way into the human food chain. High in protein and nutrients, they are being used to create sustainable and nutritious food products. Cricket farming is also on the rise. They grow quickly, require minimal resources, and produce a high yield of protein without any of the environmental damage. The process begins with the setup of breeding containers. These containers are filled with a substrate material, such as coconut fiber or vermiculite, which provides a suitable environment for crickets to lay their eggs. Male and female crickets are then introduced into the containers for successful reproduction. Female crickets lay their eggs in the substrate. Each female can lay hundreds of eggs, which will hatch into tiny nymphs after an incubation period of about 10 to 14 days. Once the eggs hatch, tiny nymphs emerge and begin their growth journey. These nymphs are highly active and require a nutrient-rich diet to support their rapid development. Egg crates, a common household item, play a crucial role in cricket farming. Crickets naturally seek out dark and secure spaces, and the crevices of egg cartons offer the perfect hiding spots. This not only mimics their natural habitat, but also helps in maintaining a healthy and stress-free environment, offering both shelter and space for these tiny insects. Plus, they are cost-effective and easy to replace. Crickets require a balanced diet, rich in proteins, carbohydrates, vitamins, and minerals. Farmers usually use a mix of grains like oats and corn, along with fresh vegetables and protein supplements. Feeding trays are strategically placed inside the containers, making it easy for the crickets to access their food. This method ensures even distribution and prevents overcrowding at feeding spots. Crickets are omnivorous and will eat a wide range of foods. This variety not only keeps them healthy, but also mimics their natural diet in the wild. In addition to solid food, crickets need a reliable source of water. Farms often use hydration gels or water tubes to provide a consistent supply of moisture without the risk of drowning. Crickets typically take about six to eight weeks to grow from nymphs to adults ready for harvest. Several species of crickets are commonly used for farming. Akita domesticus, also known as house cricket, light brown or tan in color, is the common species used for farming, primarily used for human consumption. This species is widely used due to its fast growth rate, high reproductive capacity, and adaptability to different environments. Crickets are boiled in hot water to disinfect any remaining bacteria and pathogens and helps in maintaining a consistent flavor and color. The dried crickets are ground into a fine powder using industrial grinders or mills. 
Cricket powder is usually packaged in airtight, moisture-proof containers to maintain freshness. Finished products are stored in a cool and dry place until they are shipped to consumers or retailers. Cricket powder is becoming a popular ingredient in the culinary world, especially for baking and protein shakes. Cricket powder is also an excellent addition to protein shakes, offering a natural and sustainable source of protein.